I'm in disbelief on how fast this came. Remember that lamp that was scratched? Well, Ikea already sent the new replacement one and I get to keep the old one. If you come on over here, there is a tiny noticeable scratch. Well, you can't really notice it from this light, but it's right here. Ikea said this would take up to three weeks. Well, three weeks and someone knocked on my door this morning. I was like, what the heck? Also, it already came open, so that's a little bit weird. But a new lamp came, so let me set this up, bad, this bad boy up real quick. It's the same one, just not scratched. I think I'm gonna put this one in my room, but if you guys missed what it's called, Upvind, Upvind. I don't recommend this at all. I think setting up furniture is my new favorite thing to film. I thought I would always want furniture to come to like already set up, but setting up easy things like easy, like furniture like this is actually funner than I thought, even though funner isn't a word. It's a Kyle word. There's, there's lots of Kyle words as you guys know. That is one of them. I mean, this isn't hard. It is quite insane though that it costs the company more to return your scratched item than send you a new one. It just baffles me how much these companies make that it costs more for that. So this one looks good, no scratches. If you guys remember too, they originally offered me $30, just $30 back on the $110 purchase. I said, nah, I'd rather return it. Return it. And then they said, have a new one. And I said, okay, thank you so much. Five minutes later and we're done. Super simple. Personally, I think I would have put it out there, but Casey says put it in my room, so it's gonna go in my room. Right here in this corner looks fine. Look at that, look at that. Now we got a lamp. Looks perfect right there. I love it. Side note, I know a lot of you guys are saying to get a table. I'm still searching for one, and I don't even know if I'm gonna get one before I move, but I think I need to get bar stools because if you guys saw the other video, you know that <laughs> we just put a towel down and eat on the floor. It's pretty bad. It is pretty bad, but I'm actually gonna head back to my old place right now because I gotta pick up some few last things, say hi to JoJo, return some things, and maybe possibly go to Disney. We'll see, we'll see. Another side note, do any of you guys even wanna see Disney World videos anymore? Like, I'm just curious because like I, I look at, I'm a, I'm a huge analytics guy, huge analytics. I know I go every day. I was really excited about yesterday's video, Hollywood Studios. It did okay, it did all right. It seems like my lifestyle videos have been doing a little bit better. Just kind of throwing it out there for you guys to comment down below. What are you guys' thoughts? Do you guys wanna see more of this? Cause I think I'm gonna do like a spontaneous day of, well, I'm first going back to my old place with Jojo. We're gonna catch up with him and then maybe do some online shopping. Changing it up, changing it up. Changing it up. Well, it's gonna change shirts too because I tend not to wear this color outside, but if I'm not going to the Disney park today, I'm not, I'm not gonna change because I sweat a lot. And gray, if you didn't know, it's not really the color you wear in Florida when you sweat a lot, cause I do. Tomorrow though is staycation Sunday. Can anybody guess where we're staying? Cause I can. I'm also growing the beard out because uh, my barber is actually coming back and I'll probably introduce you to him. I've been going to him for like two years. He's gonna, he's gonna shape it up before we go on our trip or mysterious trip next week before Disneyland. I was gonna go to Disney Park today, but hey, things just came up and quite honestly, I'd rather not go today. It's hot as you guys can tell. All this kind of started when I just realized that I actually have an old Spectrum bill from my last place. So I was like, Jojo, are you, are you home? We gotta figure this out. Currently I owe $275 on my last bill, which I was like, what? I could have sworn I paid it off. But I just had to return the equipment and I guess I had one more bill that is owed. So with that, let's get going. I have a dedicated drawer for the keys and wallet and sunglasses. Casey didn't like it here, so she gave me my own drawer. You know what I could do? I could shop at Spirit Halloween today. That might be in the cards. Oh, it was open already. Even though the elevator is working, I'm still a stairs guy. I just feel like sometimes I need to exercise. 
speaking of exercise, I really need to exercise. I need to get back into working out, but I've been saying that for so darn long. Even though I have ballet trash, I don't want to leave this out there for them. It's so much work, so we're taking it down ourselves. Oh, it's hot. Speaking of weather, did anybody see the hurricane that might be hitting Los Angeles? Hopefully it doesn't go to Los Angeles because that would not be good. Regardless, we're headed to my old place. Kind of can't wait to see it. I don't think I'm going to be able to film it because I don't think JoJo has even done like an update. So we'll probably go on the balcony and just catch up. On the topic of uh, the Disney parks, you guys got to let me know what you want. A lot of you guys were saying I had a lot of lifestyle last week, which I did because I had a lot going on in my life. But as soon as I post like a Disney video, it's just like, where'd you guys go? So, do you want more Disney? Do you want me to stop vlogging? Should I just fall off the face of the planet? <laughs> That's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen. That's all jokes. But on the real, do we want more Disney? I know we want more travel. Travelers are beginning next week. But in the meantime, what do you guys wanna see? Do you even wanna see? theme parks anymore you guys gotta let me know wow looks like disney is cutting down some uh, trees over here they're probably gonna extend the road that i'm on because this kind of does get a little bit a little bit congested nice progress i will say though today is one of those days where i don't really know what to do as a creator so we're just gonna do stuff that i need to do or just want to do as me being me does that make sense? Because I was going to go to, to Magic Kingdom as a creator, but then, like I said, I saw yesterday's video. I was like, ah, maybe you guys don't want to see Disney right now. So here we are, living our best life as we're passing the new Polynesian DVC Extension Hotel. Did you guys see the gas prices right now? $4.51 for premium, $3.81 for regular gas. Woo! And the stock market's dropping. What is going on? It really doesn't feel like I don't live over here anymore. I kind of feel like I'm going back home at the moment. It's very strange. Very strange indeed. And just like that, we're back. And we did just surpass 187,000 subscribers. So thank you guys. That is a pretty big milestone. We're almost to 200,000. We're almost there. It is kind of odd though, showing up here knowing my room isn't here anymore, but it's such a good feeling, you know? It's such a good feeling. Just gotta go pick up some things that I left behind. So let's go. This is so weird. Bittersweet. Let's see if it's locked or open. Huh? Locked. Oh, I did leave this behind. I think I'll leave that there. Oh yeah, and the welcome mat's still here too. Well, look at who it is, everybody. Whoa, good morning, everybody. Well, it's, it's not noon yet. <laughs> it's good morning to you, yeah. probably. Listen, I'm still jet lagged from Dubai. I, I, it's crazy. I wake up at like 5 a.m. and I can't go back to bed. So it's been a rough transition for me. But I hope you guys are having a good time. Glad to be back on Kyle's vlog. Yeah, glad to be back here. Yeah, yeah, look, yeah. Look, look, look at this. Hey, we cleaned up and you'll see it later. Not his, but one day soon. Yeah, not on mine. I literally had to come back for this and my medication. Your camera is like really off. There's a lot of dead space up here, is but sometimes weird? people oh, like that. I think this is a bad, this is a bad, just scoot up. So what's life without me? Um, it's definitely different. It's definitely different. I think the hardest thing is not having like a direct coworker. Fortunately, my roommates now do social media as well, but Those on the direct spectrums. coworkers too. Yeah. I saw know. a uh, Instagram post you guys just did. Oh, right yeah, here. yeah, we filmed, right yeah, yeah. We're trying to actually use the apartment for content. That's exactly what I'm trying to do, yeah. too. Hey, we're on the same path. I struggled with it last time because, you know, it was just like, it's different. Yeah, not the cleanest. Oh, this. But it's clean now. It's it clean is, now. It is it's clean, clean now. now. But yeah, I mean, I miss you. But I mean, it was like time in a way. Like, we lived together for so long. So, I mean, that's just life. You just grow up. You move on. We're all friends, you know. Having, <laughs> I've seen. I haven't seen Dan. <laughs> yeah, I haven't seen Dan either. Yeah. I haven't R. seen R. Dan in like six months. Yeah, I miss him. But anyway, six it's, months. So it's been good. How about you? It's been good. I live by another school. Oh, you do? Does it um, make, does it play Disney sounds? No, it does. It's not as cool as this one. Yeah, this one is kind of um, crazy. I get to Disney way faster now. I went to Hollywood Studios last night, five minutes. Wow. Because, you know, it's like right there. That's Celebration. Crazy. Yeah, no. Not me. 15. There's that music again. You know, it's funny. I, uh, I always remember that school's back in session when I hear 
that stuff going down. So that's school's, good. School's in session down here. I know it begins, I think, in like a week and a half, two weeks up north. But everyone's down in school over here. Yeah. Well, do you have any plans or anything fun and exciting to? Well, I'll see. I, I don't know. I don't Wait, know are, you going, are you? Yeah, yeah. Did you decide? Yeah, what? A gig? Disneyland? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I'm doing a gig. Oh, where are you staying? I don't know. Where are you staying? Uh, I'm staying at the, ha the, the Howard the Johnson. Whole joke. Yeah, the I got I got to email them. They always hook it up. They're yeah, always they really they nice. Do. This ain't this ain't sponsored. Casey will be there. Oh, that's good. Um, I'm going. I'm. Mm, I, I can't. Mm, I don't want to say anything. I, I can't say. I'm going with Chris at some point, oh, yeah, yeah. but not not the first night. I'm going a couple times. So I actually might go to unannounced probably for the first time. Uh, Mario Land. So oh. Land. Haven't done that yet. I haven't been there either. You haven't. Yeah. No, oh, I thought you did. I went, I went to it in Japan, and then I lost all my footage, and then uh, I cried on a bullet train uh, for two hours. I say, oh, I have a surprise trip too. No one knows about it yet. Before Disneyland. Oh, well, that's um, like kind of soon. Yeah, next week. Uh, yeah. I got no surprise trips. It's not like a big one though. It's not, it's not Dubai. No, <laughs> you're not. You're not going to it's Dubai. It's not across seas. You're not going to Sea World Abu Dhabi, which I will no. say, spoiler, I haven't posted yet. Freaking crazy. I bet they have a drone show. Yeah, you told me. Oh, yeah, well, I, that was, they have a drone show, guys. It's nuts. I had no idea. It was lovely. But was uh, nuts. yeah, no, I want to go on at least one to two more trips before the end of the year. I love traveling. I don't know about you, but like, I think mixing traveling and Disney and Florida content has been a lot healthier for me. I like it too. That's what we're doing today. Cause like I was going to Disney parks. So I was like, ah. I really, I've really been enjoying doing lifestyle mixing up. I thought about going to Spirit Halloween today. Um, just different. I love shopping. I love <laughs> shopping. I think I'm addicted to it. I just decorating my place. Shopping vlogs are fun when I allow myself to do it. Krista wants to do like a, a she buys my whole wardrobe vlog. Do it. That's what Casey wants to do too. They, um, she wants to do that. She wants to, well, she already bought pretty much all my furniture. Yeah. No, I mean, I, I saw the Ikea one. We went yeah. to Ikea. It was fun. I love yeah. Ikea. But my Ikea lamp just came today. <laughs> Yeah, she suggests that's everything a, to buy. I'm like, okay, I'll buy it. I'll buy it. I'll buy it. Let's do it. Whatever. I mean, she has more of an eye for it than I do. This is kind of like a podcast. Yeah, we're, this is like a mini podcast. This we should. A, we never did a mini. We never. We never did a podcast. It's too much we did. Work. We did try merch. It's it kind of worked. But kind of worked. Yeah, but then it just. Wait, what, what? What else did we do? I mean, Georgia. Before recording, Georgia was talking about the Halloween parties that he used to throw. Yeah, he used to throw um, Halloween parties here. <laughs> I mean, we used to do this. I'm not a partier. At all. I mean, even me now, I'm not, um, I, I still like to party, but it's definitely wearing and tearing on my body these days. Yeah. Jeep likes to go out more than me now. Yeah. That man's crazy. Maybe, maybe I should wake him up before you leave. I mean, I'm almost 30 and I'm just like, ah, That's I'd rather crazy. go to Trader Sam's. I'd rather go than downtown. It's weird because I like to, I like to go out. You know what it is? I don't like to party in the same spots. I like the nightlife. I like, like, and not in a weird way of like getting wasted. I just like seeing what other places have to offer the vibe. So when I okay, travel, I don't I do it. When you, I don't when you go, go on cruise ships, you'll just go up there and be like, ah, this is cool. Yeah, yeah. I just like, like, like your I last like, virgin. I remember you doing that. Yeah, yeah. I, I just like, I like capturing the nightlife for a little bit and then having fun and dancing a lot. But I mean, that's you in cruises. I'm strictly like, I just want to vlog, not get. Well, not saying you want to get drunk all the time, but <laughs> I mean, on cruises, I, you're a different, you're a different human. I think, and I'm just like, well, let's go. And Jojo's like, let's go. I think, and I'm like, let's go. And Jojo's like, let's go. The last cruise I did, that one I didn't drink as much. Only, only on, only during Barcelona night and uh, Mykonos night. Those nights, I partied. partied. But the, but the, you know, random thing, random thing. I learned the cruises like internationally are more about the location. I've oh, never yeah. spent, so I've man. spent so much time off the ship compared to like when you're sailing well, out of Miami, you're gonna party. Well, like when we go to the Bahamas, we go to the Bahamas all the time. So it's like, yeah. we'd rather stay on the ship. You know, you gotta check out the new terminal. I do, I do. I haven't been on a cruise in forever. That's something I'm trying to squeak in here this year. Guys, do you think Kyle should do another cruise? Let us know. You know what I will say though, speaking about Disney, which is really cool, which I love. I've been seeing so many more content creators. Oh, there's so many. Like, 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 like so, so many. many, so many. Not like it's a bad thing. It's no. I just I remember when it cool. used to not be cool. Yeah, yeah. right. Like when I got oh made my fun gosh, of it we used to get time. made fun of all the time. Back I mean, on the scene, we still get made fun of, but that's just free advertising. <laughs> that, 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 that's, <laughs> that's just free advertising. That's being a Disney adult. <laughs> yeah. I think every yeah. Disney. But yeah, no, it's like when I did my Mickey's, I didn't see you, but. The amount of comments and just videos I saw, so like, many. and I was just like, who, who are you? Which is yeah. exciting. I'm excited to 
hopefully meet up with some of them. You're in the you're definitely someone that meets up with more creators. I'm definitely more introvert, and that's how I've always been. Yeah, yeah. Like even early on, you just like going like with Taya comes to mind. Ah. I just yeah, like, I don't know, I just, I'm very introvert with everything. But like, you, it's weird. But you know, but I need to get back to that. I think maybe just because of traveling or because I haven't been in Disney so much, I'm like, I don't know, I, I, don't, I don't get to see as many people anymore. Like, I don't. I mean, because we're so busy. I think uh, that at the end of the day, like, we love making content and we want to be efficient. But like, hanging out with people, that's fun. So like, you, there's a balance. And I think true. recently... I've been trying to work on that balance, like getting back into hanging out with people. Cause it's easy to go and just vlog and then come home sometimes. But I would, my goal for the rest of the year is to hang out with at least two new content creators. I already have one target friend who I don't, I don't know. You don't her. disclose? You don't no, 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 disclose? No, 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 I don't know. I, I don't know her name. Oh, okay. She was really cool. And I actually felt bad cause she met I me I mean, once. it's, it's a good thing to do if you like, you want to grow more and stuff. I'm just so introvert. Like it's, it's different. You know what I was thinking of too? Like, cause I live by myself now. It's totally different. Like yesterday yeah. it was just me by myself yeah. all day. Yeah. And you know, like I would just come in and annoy the crap out of you sometimes. Or I would wake you up or something. Yeah. It's usually me annoying you, honestly. Hmm. I will say I, I, if there's one thing, I have to be honest, there's one, if there's one thing I don't miss <laughs> is you singing in a shower. Uh, <laughs> that was rough. I don't know how you did it. Cause his, his bathroom was attached. I don't know how you did it. I strategically didn't want that because I know how Jojo can be sometimes. <laughs> Jojo likes to leave the lights on, likes yeah. to be loud. Yeah, <laughs> what, what do we not miss about each other? That is that, hilarious. So that one, and then the only other one I will say, which I feel like it's not a bad thing, and this is not to like to make you feel bad or make you conscientious. Oh, go for it. But you're whistling too sometimes. Oh, dude, someone, I was whistling in the park yesterday mm. and he's like, wait, are you trying to get a hold of someone? I was like, no, I just like the whistle. Yeah, no, your whistling's good sometimes, but sometimes it was I like more like bird calling. Like it would just, it would, like it, and again, confessions, I, didn't know I, I guess. I whistled that much. Yeah, even Dan brought it up. Really? Yeah, and he lived over here. Wait, I whistled a lot? Not, not a lot, it's just when you did whistle. See, see that's okay, that's cool, but then if you do it a lot, yeah. The way that the, the, the oh, like the oct like do that thing you do oh, 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 oh. like oh that one yeah that one that one kind of that one kind of when you're hungover that can actually hit you in the head <laughs> <laughs> but that's all other than that it's all it's all dandy yeah what times what times you should you should you could tell this video now why JoJo made me move out <laughs> we don't like each other oh, remember that one time I said we got in a fight. Remember that it was a Hollywood Studios, they were celebrating, I think, their 20th anniversary. We and they, probably did. We got in fights. And we they probably had, did. Well, yeah, but no, this was a this was a, a sensational title in mind. And Indiana Jones came down the street and they had a whole choreographed street fight. I don't remember this. You know, the 20th birthday or the 30th birthday oh. in Hollywood Studios. And there was a huge fight. It was sick. It was going down Hollywood Boulevard. Some of you guys definitely remember that. And Kyle and I watched it, and this is really, really early on. Like, Were we by Starbucks? Yeah. Oh, okay. And we watched it, and I titled the video, we got in a fight. Did you get a lot of clicks? I don't know. For me back then, I think I did. <laughs> You're like, yay! I was just happy. 5,000, baby. I was ooh, a young whipper. Hey, I'm happy for 5,000 today. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> oh, oh, boy. <laughs> but, yeah. So. Anything other juicy? I gotta get going here soon, though, too. No. I mean, there's a lot of, there's a lot of more juice, but... There's I mean, no tea, we'll, nothing. Yeah, we're good. We're good. I I mean, we're good with everyone too. Yeah. Like seriously, I don't know. Yeah, I, 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 I got I, no you know, you know, at the end that. of the day, my biggest philosophy is, well, two things. One, treat others how you like to be treated. So I truly try to treat everyone with respect, even if I don't agree with some of their content or if I don't like it, I just move on. You feel yeah. me? Yeah, I, I, just, I just I just watch it and I'm like, ah, okay. And the second thing is, um, and that was basically the first one. What was I gonna say? I don't know. That's what I say all the time. What was I gonna say? I don't know. No, there was one more good thing just about people in general. Oh, it takes more effort to be mad at someone than to, you know, like, it, like, you know, it's, I have- took a weird turn, but I'm here for it. We're, we're on a podcast though, we're just talking. Anyway, well, you asked for any juice, but yeah, anyway, yeah, yeah. one thing I do want to do, and this is from Future Plans, I want to get on a vlog with Kyle and I want to make something different, something cool. So, something that's just like not a daily thing. I want to. I'm gonna plan it. Stay tuned. I'm gonna get him out one day when he's free. It's gonna be fun. I don't know what it is yet, but it's gonna be nuts. It's gonna be insane. 
I feel like this was a JoJo Venn session, and I'm just, I was just here listening. I mean, I, no, I felt come like on. I felt I felt I felt I nice. Think, I think it's a Kyle JoJo Venn session. I think we're just catching up. It's been a minute. This was fine. What are you doing next? Uh, I gotta go to UPS store. Return that. Gotta get my two hundred dollars back. What? Is what? What's the craziest thing you're gonna do for the rest of the day to keep that retention so people stay until the end of the video? I'm gonna sleep. Everyone clicks out right now. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. I got now. nothing. I got nothing. Good I to got, see. Good to see you guys. I, I miss nothing. you. I got nothing. Check out my Dubai vlogs. How long was that? Did my camera overheat. Twelve minutes. Sometimes you just gotta let JoJo talk. That was that was a good catch. It. We catch up a lot off camera too. But I do have my medicine. We got about 30 minutes until this goes bad, so we have to rush home. That is my medication that I take monthly, and I haven't updated you guys on that in a while on my story with Humera, but I gotta drop this off here real quick because I feel like if I talked more about my story with Humera again, my journey, it might help out some of you guys. Because a lot of you guys reached out to Casey about her pots, and it might have helped a couple of you guys out. Hello. You know I'm the only one. I will say though, Spectrum does make it easy to, re to return old equipment. It's free of charge and they ship it back. Pretty nice, pretty nice. By the way, vlogging in public like this, if you're wondering if everyone looks, pretty much everyone looks. But I think, it, you think it would be normal by now because a lot of people do it. Pretty good looks, it's kind of interesting. All right, back home we go. So this right here, ladies and gentlemen, is called Humera. Has been a while since I've updated you guys on this situation, and since we're kind of doing a lifestyle today, might as well talk about it. Last year was kind of a struggle year for finding affordable drug for me. Like I was thinking about actually switching from Humira because if you guys didn't know, that little packet right there is $4,000 without insurance. And the problem I was running into last year was my insurance wasn't gonna cover it. And then all these little workarounds that I've been using for the past couple of years to get it to be like a dollar, they weren't covering it. So my mom and I had to find like a team to kind of work together and we found one little workaround for it to get down to $1 instead of me having to pay 4,000. And I know Mark Cuban's actually had, Mark Cuban's um, pharmacy online actually has an alternative to that is a little bit cheaper. It doesn't really make sense for me to, to switch to that just because even though it's it's technically the same thing, um, uh, rheumatologists don't like to switch you once they find something that's been working for you. And I've been on Humira for literally quite 12, 13 years now, I, I believe since I was 18. It's 11, 11, 12 years and it's, and it's been working. But last year was a struggle because we didn't know what we were going to do. But I have ankylosing spondylitis for those who don't know and that's the drug that basically makes me be able to function every day without pain. And it was a, it was a struggle last year but we finally did it. But I think it's always going to be an ongoing battle just because it's insurance and um, I think it's going to dwindle down. I don't know. I'll keep you guys updated if you guys are interested. But we're good this year somehow. No idea. It's, it's so weird. Insurance and drugs need to change in America with how expensive they are. It's quite literally ridiculous. It's, uh, or healthcare is just a whole bunch of messed up and it's, it's not good. It's not good. Same with the housing industry. It's ridiculous. I feel like a lot of things in America right now are just taking a turn for downhill. I don't know. That's just my thoughts. You know the funny thing too, is if Casey's not here, I just make peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. I can survive our peanut butter and jelly. When I have kids, it's gonna be funny. Dad, what's for lunch? Peanut butter and jelly. I don't like that. Well, applesauce. I don't like that. Cereal. I don't like that. Well, I don't know what to tell you. You gotta start liking one of them. I love peanut butter and jelly. Quite honestly, I was gonna do some Amazon shopping here today, but the more I think about it, I don't really, I don't think I should. I, I, I think I really need to focus on with Casey is just the new table and obviously some bar stools. That's really all I need. And when we go to the next place, that's probably when I'll start going crazier, but I could start ordering Halloween stuff. I seriously am going to be changing this whole place into Halloween and we're going to do it today. We'll start a little bit. The search is going to begin on Amazon, this creepy goth cloth black thing on your right hand screen. That is something I'm probably going to buy. 
just don't need that today. I did find these cool cobwebs, gonna purchase that, as well as I think this, even though it's meant for outside, but I think I might be able to do it inside as well. And then these bats. The thing with Halloween decorations is they can be cheap and that's why sometimes I don't like to buy them online because they are super cheap if you are not careful. But this is the nice thing about Amazon. If we don't like it, we can instantly return it. All those were $41 and I'm gonna be getting it tomorrow. Perfect. But that's gonna be it for you guys' this daily dose today. Nice and simple, kind of different vlog. I'm just gonna open. Uh. I don't know why that was hard to open. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Different lifestyle type video. I figured going to uh, Disney just wasn't in the cards today. I mean, it was in the cards, but maybe you guys don't wanna see Disney videos. You guys gotta let me know and um, we'll go from there. So with that, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow is Staycation Sunday. Hope you guys are excited about this one. We haven't, I haven't stayed here in a while. See you guys tomorrow. Side note, I've got a birthday celebration tonight. Not filming it, but can't wait. It's on Disney property. I think we're going to Ohana.